What is up, dear viewers? This is Antilles Gaming here, and today we are back on A Way Out. I almost said a day's gone. <laughs> so, last time, we... That, yeah. So we have a guy ringing the doorbell over and over again. So... We're gonna go see who the heck is down there. And hopefully everything goes good, but just in case... Let's, uh... Sorry to bother you, ma'am. The lads is, uh, wondering if you've got any Blackberry ready for him. Oh, I'm working on it. In a day or two, I hope. The lads is getting a mite twitchy. To tell you the truth, I must ask you to uh, accompany me to the station so you can explain yourself to them precisely. I don't understand the worry. Haven't I always provided you with Blackberry? I just had a little hiccup in the lab. I'd be working on it right now, but apparently you lads are lonely. That ain't quite true though, Harm, is it? You've been seen all over town doing all sorts of things. We don't imagine that Lionel Kashia is much of a source of pharmaceutical ingredients. Oh, but there, you'd be wrong, Constable. See, I had to replace some bits of lab equipment. And you've been roaming around the Golden District doing Lord knows what. Yes, well, I, um... Uh, Blackberry's made with herbal extracts. Why do you think it's called Blackberry? And the Victorial Memorial Camp? Two visits in the last week? I suppose them visits was for our benefit as well. Not at all. I was visiting the General. He also gets quite cross when I haven't seen him in a while. Oh, uh, so he... Uh, well, yes, yes, of course he would. Uh, right. Well, we can hardly expect Miss Boyle to ignore the general now, can we, lads? Ah, uh, uh, of course he would. Nonetheless, Miss Boyle, the lads have developed an appetite for your fine cooking, as it were. If they go hungry, chaos will ensue. We must insist that you devote your full and urgent attention to feeding them. Or what? Or we shall be compelled, willing or no, to provide your assistance, willing or no, to Dr. Verloc. And that won't be cheery for either of us. I guess I can't blame them for being antsy. It's not fun going off Blackberry. And if they go back on regular joy, they'll get the cramps, and they won't even remember why. Thank God I'm almost done with this new batch. Oh, it's a good thing that she wears a mask, because it makes it a lot easier to get around this area. Except when I run into those. But yeah, it makes getting around this area a lot easier. Because with the mask, like I said in the last episode, it makes it looks like you're smiling. So it makes it, uh, yeah, a little less harder to detect. At least I'm pretty sure she's wearing a mask. So I wonder who that uh, doctor is that they were talking about. Like, I wonder what his deal is. Oh. Are you... Okay, so it looks like we're... Gonna make a detour. I'm not gonna make y'all... Yeah, it's gonna take me a while to get there. So, I'll be right back when we get back to the lab. 
<sighs> well, after that delay, we're finally back. Does she even have our door fixed yet? She does not. Jesus. It smells like burning chemicals. Oh, shit. <gasps> Where's the fire extinguisher? Christ almighty. Jesus, no. Yeah, you see, this is why when someone's working on chemicals, you don't take her away from her lab. So they don't get their Blackberry. Well then, that's gonna be on them now, isn't it? Okay. First things first, how bad is the damage to the lab? The triode and the crystallizer's broken. Oh. Why do I get an N7 vacuum tube? Oh, God. My old chemistry box. It must be still in my old house. I was really hoping I'd never have to go back there. Oh, boy. First things first, uh, Sally needs water, so... And I do not feel like... Drinking joy water. Ah, there we go. Fill that up. Purify that. I don't know why, but I do love the sounds of the, uh, of pretty much everything in here, like all the mechanical equipment. I just love the sound of them. So where are we? Oh, no. Really? We gotta go back to the... We gotta go back to the garden district. Well, happy few the first time. I'm not gonna make y'all have to sit there watching me walk back and forth. So, I'll be right back when we, at least when we get close to the house. Cause, unless something happens, uh, unless something happens on my way there, like with a cutscene or something, then I'll be right back when we get back, when we get to her old house. Okay, so it wasn't as hard to get around as I thought. I literally just walked on the outskirts of the town. Looks like they're attacking someone over there. Hopefully we can get into the house without any incidents. Dang it. Kid. Are you... Kid. Are... <clears throat> There's literally nothing right there preventing me from going through. Ah! Fine, we'll do it your way. Sneaking, sneaking, sneaker. Well, young Miss Boyle. You know there's a curfew. You don't want some Fritz to shoot you dead, do you? Sorry, sir. Let's get you home. You had another fight with your mum, didn't you? Why don't I put in a good word? Miss, uh, Mrs. Boyle, I've got a young lady out here who, um... I'm sorry. 
They don't seem to be at home. What? Let me go in. They not at home. Let me take you to the station for a cup of tea. What happened? Let me in. Best you don't go in, miss. Cup of tea's best. What did she do? What did she do? What, what did she do? To all citizens with children, by authority of the Occupation Authority, all children who will be under the age of 13 on July 22nd should now have been registered with the town clerk. With the town clerk, please present your children at the Wellington Wells train station on the morning of July 22nd at 9 a.m. for transport to Germany. It encloses a list of clothing supplies they will need for their voyage. Note that if your children, their child has. Been, Issues with bedwetting, rubber pants, or serviettes must be provided. Prior to the voyage, school-age children should attend all an all-day orientation on July 9th at the Wellington Wells Comprehensive School. Bring a lunch. Miss Victoria Bing Bing will conduct an an orientation for younger children under on July 20, 20th. With, the, with songs and games to prepare them for their trip to Germany. It is imperative that parents portray this travel as an exciting opportunity for the youngsters. So as to avoid anxiety at the train station, please rest assured the children's absence will only be temporary. What? Did she... Poison the family? And Mum said, You don't have to worry about the train. No one's going on the train. Shut up, Sally. You're a big girl. Stop crying. Did her mom poison the family? Yeah, did did her mom poison the family so that they wouldn't have no, to? I don't think I'd like to go to the movies. So they wouldn't have to go to Germany. I mean. I can understand like a parent not wanting the kids to go, but that's taking it a bit far.
get my old chemistry set, but it's not letting me. It's saying I need a lock pick, but I'm. Um... Mother's blood. The wolf said, "Oh, do cats ever tell the truth?" Sure, sure, the cat, and he won't bother you anymore. So little old Riley Good threw her left shoe at the cat, and he never bothered her again. That makes me hungry, said little old Riley Good. I thought you some ham. So little old Riley Good made a ham. She sat on the cat, and she ate right up. And that's for ditching me for the posh girls in year seven. What? Posh girls? What? Okay, I don't. Let me see if I can try to figure out what the heck I need to do to to get a lockpick. <sighs> Took a while, but I managed to finally get a lockpick. We managed to. I just went outside, found one of the policemen. Yeah, sure enough that they had one. So let's see about what's in this room. Oh <sighs> yeah, that's been playing for a while. A beaker, a thermostat, N7 triode. I think I can fix my lab. You think or you know? Okay, guys, I don't want to have come all this way for an I think <sighs> okay so I'm just gonna leave the same way that I came basically all I did was I went way out basically right next to the river lake whatever you want to call it yeah I just went way out over here and just walked along the edge I'm a Sally on the edge. But yeah. So, there are some ways to basically trick the game or whatever. But, I mean, I wouldn't really call this a trick. I mean, we're not cheating the system or anything. Oh, I want to try to get some of these. I mean, we're not tri tricking the system or anything. We're just going along the edge where people don't notice us as much those people creep me out also uh what I'm, I was talking to one of my friends uh send the villain and uh JB on I mentioned it to him uh whenever the like whenever uh call of duty the new call of duty comes out I'm going to be getting the uh, collector's edition, which comes with the night vision goggles. Yeah, I know some people say it's a waste of money, but then again, it's my money, so. So yeah, I was thinking of uh, doing an unboxing video. Like, you know, just showing off, like, well not showing off, but like, showing the night vision goggles, because from what I heard, much like Modern Warfare 2, these will be actual working night vision goggles. And I already have a helmet that, uh, it looks kind of like a military helmet that I wore to Comic Con last, last year. And figured, I mean, it might look good with the helmet. Because it does look like a uh, military night vision goggles. Which. Christ, that's a lot of plague victims. 
I guess they all want to go home. I guess they've forgotten why they're here in the garden district. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. Right, Joyce. <laughs> okay, I can just get around him. Let me in! Let me in! Hello. Let's have a look at you, shall we? You're in tip top shape, aren't you? You were so pleased you survived the garden district. Toodle. <sighs> yeah, I'm happy too, buddy. I'm happy too. <sighs> now all I gotta do is tr start taking joy until I can get home. Also, I'm still trying to figure out when's the last time I played We Happy Few. Are you feeling all right, Mom? <laughs> Why are they attacking me? <sighs> like, I, I'm just. I was probably injured whenever I was walking. There! The woman blood on her hands! That's the guilty bugger! What right there! <laughs> Oh boy. Well, it's night time, so there's going to be a few police out, so let's see what the... Okay, so I gotta go this way. Are you kidding me? Let me run, let me run, let me run. Let me run, I'm not having fun. <sighs> okay, I don't know if y'all are noticing it, but like every now and then, uh, like every now and then my game like does like this buzz sound. Like, I don't know why it's doing that. But, like I said in the last episode also, uh, this game does have a few bugs. Like, it it can get a little buggy sometimes. Okay, so I'm still being chased by the police, but the way I see it, if I can make it back to my house, maybe if I lock myself in the lab, it'll... Like, it'll stop them. Like, maybe that'll... Help me escape. This is not the time for this. Seriously, I wonder if I get a, like, PS4 Pro or something. If it's gonna be, like, less loading screens or something. You might want to see a doctor, Mom. You're only making it harder on yourself. No, you don't. We all appreciate what you do. It's a good thing that door locks. Now I just need to replace all my chemicals. Stuart. I've got to talk to Stuart. Maybe he's got the chemicals I need squirreled away somewhere. Uh First things first, if we're going out again. Uh oh. Uh Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? Where's it? to give you gym when your teeth comes in. 
My mum always said she knew I'd go wrong because of the way I cried for Jim when I was a baby. Yes, darling. Mummy was precocious. <laughs> Someday, when you have teeth, you'll be able to eat mummy's cooking. I know what you're thinking. But I'm a very good cook. Though my mum complained I never followed a recipe. I was always inventing my own. All right. I did blow up one cake. I never heard the end of it, did I? Well, you and I will cook up such lovely meals when we're in the countryside. So we know that she has a daughter, obviously. But what we don't know, who's the dad? Also, I know that we were about to leave, but I noticed the time up there, so we are going to go sleep till it is daytime. Because I am not going through that again. Give me my health. I was badly beaten with, pa with batons, so I must heal by sleeping. Uh, video game logic. Can you imagine, though? Like, in real life. Oh. Oh, lovely. On top of everything, I'm sick. Yep, I kind of took a risk on that. Okay, uh, let's see if uh, we drink something, maybe, if that will... Oh, 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 are you kidding me? There was bread! Uh, I am bread. No, I am not drinking from the tap because that is going to then make me... Are you... Kidding me? And I was just thinking earlier... Hmm, I wonder if I ever have to, uh... Like, swap things out? Metal tube... So I just need a metal tube and I can... Do a filter... But I don't under I don't I just don't get where would I get a metal tube? <sighs> so where are we going now? Uh I find components to craft blackberry joy zero out of four. How do I do the do? Okay, seriously, how do I make blackberry joy? Blackberry joy, blackberry joy, blackberry joy, blackberry joy. Okay, really, where do I find out how I make blackberry joy? Told us that earlier. 
Uh, sorry. It's just I haven't played this game in a while, so I'm kind of still getting back into the swing of things. Which actually, whenever I look, she killed yeah. my sisters, you know, to keep them from being scared. What about me being scared? Okay. So yeah, apparently the last time that I played this actually wasn't this year. Last time I played this, I think I'm pretty sure I was still playing uh, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Like I think I was playing this at the beginning of the Let's Play for Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and then after that we went on to uh, Red Dead 2. So basically, it's almost been a year since the last time I played We Happy Few. Huh. Bloody revolvers. I've got a sunshine somewhere, haven't I? Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. <sighs> Crafted a bunch of those and I've already had to use them all up. Okay, looks like we got a bit ways to go, so I shall return when we have reached our destination. I don't know what I, voice I was trying to do. Don't know if that was Sidious or something else, but yeah. Well, I'll be right back when we get there. <sighs> Yeah, so we, uh, we had a few difficulties, but finally managed to make it here. Got a little too close to one of those, uh, doctors. And I wasn't taking joy, so you can about imagine how that went. Well, if it isn't Sally Boyle. Himself is upstairs tinkering. When will he be? It's been weeks now. It's a device you left behind. Apparently, it's quite clever and complex. I just came to buy some chemicals. Over my cold, dead body. Fiona. It's not just borrowing my man while you were here. I could have got over that. It's the ambitions you put into him. Fiona, I'm sorry. He wants to be more than a village chemist. How's that, I says? Will you go to London to study to be a doctor? Will you take over Hayworth Labs? She still wouldn't take you back, I says. But you sold him the stars. And now he can't barely see where he's going. Maybe he liked me because I thought he could be more. Do you ever think of that? Get out of here. Get out, you witch. And don't let the door hit you in the ass on the way out. Don't you look well? I do. You're looking fine today. Get out of here. Get out, you witch! And don't let the door hit you in the arse on the way out. Well, she's mellowed. Fiona said Stuart's been working on my old pituitary extractor. Maybe... Maybe I can get it back from him later, when she's not in the shop. Wait. Harry Cavendish. He still works with the labs, doesn't he? And he owes me a favour. I'll drop by his house. I swear it better This is another problem that I always disliked with We Happy Few. The the distance like you go all the way to one area. Like look, I just came from that area and I already gotta go all the way back. <sighs> I mean I know that's how most games are, but with We Happy Few, they have a. S I don't know. Reminds me of that uh, tank mission on uh, Battlefield 5. Literally, the entirety of the mission, like all the missions, are just. Gotta go this way. First mission, 
go to the bridge. Second mission, go back to the base. Third mission, go halfway to the bridge. Fourth mission, go back to the base. Last mission, fight, make your last stand at the bridge. It is an endless loop of going back and forth. Harry? It's Sally. Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. Sally Boyle. Well, I haven't seen you in a dog's age. What? What happened to your eyes? Oh, this little thing. A doctor used miscalculated the brominating reaction and it blew up in my face. Then he convinced Dr. Verloc it was my fault. So I got the sack. That weasel. Oh, you don't have to pretend you're interested in the tedious old lab. How's the glamorous life of an experimental chemist? It's a bit blocked at the moment. Can't get mercury amalgam. Did you know they vent gallons of it onto rat home? Oh, well, you wouldn't. You've moved on to greener pastures. I'm sorry. I thought Anton knew what he was doing. Oh, I don't blame you for leaving us all behind. When love fades, you have to move on. Well, I'm sure you'll figure out where to find some amalgam. Maybe I will. But someone's got to prove it was Dr. Hughes's fault you lost your eyes. You know, you're right. He could hurt someone else. Is there... any evidence that it was his fault? You know, now that you mention it, his lab notes. He keeps them in his doctor bag. I bet they're all the evidence I need. Oh, you know what? I bet they'd also tell me how to extract the amalgam you need out of the stuff the lab is piping onto Rat Home. I'll get you his lab notes. Here's where he lives. Come back, and I'll tell you where to find the pump outlet. Don't go anywhere. Wouldn't dream of it. Well, looks like he's blind, and it also looks like we're going back all the way where we just were. Lovely weather. Did you hear about Constable Rossetti's wife's cake? I think she's supposed to be leaning on his shoulder. Uh, I don't think that relationship's gonna work. Victory. Who doesn't remember the victory? Yeah, I'm not risking going that way. I gotta have getting lost and then have him go come all the way back just to go around. I can't wait for the new shipment of vegetables. You can take your joy immediately. You gotta remember to stay away from those uh TV screens. <sighs> but yeah, we're gonna go do mm -mm. And I know, I know, some people would say, well, why don't you just take the joy? It's, it'll, things just walk right past them. Look, I would, but if I don't need to take joy, then I really would rather not. Because, like, I can just walk by people. Because, like I said, she's wearing a mask, so she... Is already giving off the impression that she's happy or whatever. So, not really a point in taking the joy. I swear, if this ends up being the same place that we were just at. No, it is at the same place that we were just at, but it is right next to it. Malaka Mashaka. Wow. You can't say Dr. Hughes doesn't have a keen sense of style. I'd better be particularly careful. They were all like you. If he knows I'm there, we'll get nasty fast.
chuck something in case I need to run. Ah, I forgot I'm not fully upgraded anymore. Okay, uh... Why'd I pick this up? Ah, so there is a throwing feature. Okay, we're almost there. No, you may not use my loo. Gross. How do I throw? How do I throw? How do I throw? How do I throw? Brick. Some. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can. Let me, I still don't have anything to do that. Wait. So I need it. Are you? I thought I could just make those at any time. I didn't know I had to actually go to a crafting table. Okay, let's see. Uh. So why why can't why can't I use a oh whatever? Did you think I? <laughs> oh boy, he has a chainsaw. Yeah, so, uh, he had a chainsaw. <sighs> Just this must be the bag Harry wanted. Literally just instantly resorted to, I'm gonna cut you up with a chainsaw. Okay, we're gonna go try to get back to Harry. We're gonna try to go back to Harry, and then we will call it an episode. Just gotta make it out of this house. Can I just? No, I can't. Come on, come on. Oh, uh, also.
Okay. Just go right in. Quite a sturdy bag. I wonder if Gwen would fit in here. She'd need to be able to breathe. Some source of oxygen and soundproofing in case she starts crying. I bet Lionel could make something like that. Didn't see you at the pub. Uh, you know. Uh, don't you think asking Lionel for a little too much might be a little risky? <sighs> But yeah, anyway, what I was saying was, uh, Borderlands 3 will be coming out next month. So, as far as right now, I don't know if my friends are getting it. So, as far as I know, only I'll be getting don't it. Don't worry. Mommy's not really helpless. Men like it if you let them play the hero. So, as far as I know, only I'll be getting it as of now. But if I can get like some uh, uh, my friends playing it, we might do a a co-op uh, thing. Now it would be me. It would be some of the other people that we met on that well, like y'all met on a uh, met or seen, however you want to phrase it, on the Sea of Thieves Sea of Thieves video that we saw. Uh, it would probably be Mork. Because I'm pretty sure he said he was interested in it. Uh, Gablin. Although, I'm pretty sure some of y'all remember him. He was the one that had the blunderbuss. <laughs> and may maybe Alpha. I'm not sure if he's getting it. I would have to ask. But yeah, just uh, something to look forward to. Harry? It's Sally. Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. Did you get Dr. Hughes's bag? I've got it. Aren't you Brillo? Well, here's the formula you'll need. You can get to Rat Home via the maintenance tunnels. There's a code at the door. It's 1649. I really am sorry about the accident. I thought Anton had a handle on things. Well, now we know. Cheerio. Like other babies, Gwen needs a diaper changed. Attend to her before time runs out. That's nasty. I'll need a few things before I go. I can get there from any hatch now that I've got the code. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the house and check on Gwen and then in the next episode well this will all happen in the next episode so yeah in the next episode we're gonna check on Gwen and then we're going to head over to Rat Home to get the ingredients that we need <sighs> it is good to be back on this game which is it's kind of fitting because like I said uh Last year, around this time of the year, that's when I started playing We Happy Few. In fact, August 28th. <laughs> yeah, like, so in a few days, it'll be like the very first time that I ever played We Happy Few. Can't believe it's been that long. And after Sally, then we're gonna have a uh, Ali Ali Oxen free. But yeah, I honestly can't wait to play as Ali, cause from what I heard, his story is pretty. It's a pretty fun one to play. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. So, my dear viewers, with all that being said, thanks all you so much for watching. If you like to subscribe, leave a like, and as always, please leave a comment down below. Because the comments are the only way I can improve on these. And if you want to chat with me regularly or check out updates on the channel, check my Twitter and Instagram at Antilles Gaming. And with all that being said, I will see all of you in the next episode.